this week, Housemaids faced their demons <laughs> as the underworld took over. But another shock was in store, and nominations took an evil twist. Anton, Jim, who do you want to join you in facing the public vote? Jim. Harry. Who goes? You decide. to Big Brother 2011 and our sixth live eviction. Yes, lots of banners tonight. We are now just three weeks away from crowning your champion, who will not only walk out of those doors the winner, but also with a whopping £100,000 in their back pocket. That is a lot of money. It's been a spooky all week on Big Brother. I'm scared. On Monday, Anton and Jay were put up for eviction. Yes. But in a cruel twist, Big Brother removed them from the house that night and hid them in a secret crypt in the garden. <laughs> Living as ghosts, Jay and Anton lay undiscovered for two whole days. Well done. As a reward, Big Brother let the pair choose two other housemates to join them in the public vote. Anton chose Jem. And Jay chose Harry. They get so carried away here. Which now means we have four up for eviction tonight. And as usual, only you at home can save them. To save Anton, call 090-1616-1704. To save Harry, call 090-1616-1706. To save Jay, call 090-1616-1708. To save Jem, call 090-1616-1715. Calls cost 36p from a BT landline. Calls from other networks may vary and from mobiles will cost you considerably more. This series you can vote by phone or via Facebook. Simply go to our Facebook page. Remember, there is a minimum Facebook credit purchase of one pound. One vote on Facebook will cost no more than 7p. Full terms go to channel5.com slash bbvote. It's all kicking off here. So this week, our housemates had twisted nominations, a world premiere, and a fleeting visit from Katie Price. Sounds like a supernatural week to me. This week, there were two up for nomination, and Big Brother had a wicked twist. The housemates nominated for eviction this week are Anton oh, no. and Jay. In a few minutes, you will leave the Big Brother house, but you haven't been evicted yet. Anton and Jay, <gasps> both of them. You are now dead to your fellow housemates. As ghosts, you will, of course, be an all-seeing presence over the house. You didn't believe it, did you? I don't know, Harry. Oh, Louise, come on. Uh, if they have gone and got it... We've become legends. This is what Big Brother's all about. As two ghostly monsters, Anton and Jay, mashed up the house. Any more than three screams and you will fail the shopping task. They'll actually fail the task unless they scream more than three times. You could have done it a bit better, to be honest, Big Brother. 
And remember, not to scream at anything today. OK. Alex, are you missing your pet chihuahua? Yeah. What if Big Brother let Tom come in the room with you? Yes. But Ghost weren't the only ones to visit the housemates, as celebrities made a passing visit. Tonight, the world premiere of the movie Paranormal Activity 3 will take place at the Big Brother house. Uh, what? You will choose the four housemates to win tickets to the premiere and choose the three housemates who will be turned into brain-dead zombies. It's going to be Alex, Harry, Faye. Before the premiere, a load of celebrities will walk on the red carpet oh. through the house. <laughs> Go get pictures. Mate, that Lucian guy's going to try and chat up Lou. Trust it. Now what the fuck's going on? <laughs> also glamorous! And I love the way Alex cries. <laughs> so we've three men and a not-so-little lady, she's so muscly, up for eviction tonight. Before we find out who's going, it's time to catch up with yesterday's action where the effects of the underworld are getting under everyone's skin. <gasps> Dear 42, 8, 57 a.m. After a week of ghoulish goings-on, ghostly housemates Anton and Jay rose from the dead and made their return to the house in a nominations twist last night. Who do you want to join you in facing the public vote on Friday? Jim. I'm going to choose Harry. Most of the housemates are sound asleep. Jem's been in the Big Brother house for just 13 days. Today, she's facing the prospect of eviction for the first time. Isn't that a bit sad? I don't want to think about that, so I'll just push this back down and have lots of fun because there's so many people in here that I really love. I'll just be a bit sad that I won't be able to be with them. It's hard to get everyone back together again once this is over, isn't it? It's hard to get all the people that you love to stay together and have fun, and it's really strange that I feel like I've kind of fallen for them as friends in such a short space of time, and especially people that I wouldn't normally have thought that could happen with. <sighs> but then there's other people that I'm still, you know, the jaw is still out on. Even if they are nice people outside the house, it can make people... And I'm a bit more kind of devious. Nine eighteen AM. Jay and Louise are still in bed. For the past few days, Anton and Jay were confined to a secret crypt and watched their housemates every move. I do feel rude in a way, though, with like, Lou, because sometimes she'll say stuff and I'll just sort of smirk or I'll, I won't sort of listen to what she's got to say because I'm just like, whatever you say is irrelevant. Kind of thing. He, he thinks Lou's dumb. Last night, they returned to the house to reveal what they think they saw. Harry and Aaron are setting things straight. I might just ignore the situation. <laughs> <laughs> and just beat around the bush. I don't remember it being like anything vicious or anything. I said, I remember saying that um, because she was quiet for the first few weeks, she wouldn't have noticed certain things. Yeah. But. But I'm not going to kind of like be like, oh, this is Harry's mess. It's not. 
That's not. Oh right, right. no. I don't want that. Can if you want? I wouldn't bitch about someone. I'd probably go, oh, such and such is annoyed to me, what well, annoyed me today. Then you could go to, up to everyone's face constantly and just confront them on everything because you just wouldn't have any friends in there. Yeah. Yeah. I seem to remember making certain comments. Sorry? I seem to remember making certain comments. About who? Louis. Now I look like the evil bastard. But it's just annoying that it's come round from another housemate who has been watching who she trusts the most in the house. So if there's any other housemates hiding away watching this, then please feel free to relay it back to the person. That's you and I up next week, then. Well, oh, well. I'm already up this week anyway. Eleven twenty-nine a.m. Aaron is trying to unearth the truth. What do you remember of what apparently has been said about Gemma and Louise? Because this has been thrown at me, and with Louise, you would Harry were having a conversation. Yeah. Then fucking Harry was saying that she was thick. I would be quite confident for both of them to sit and watch those conversations because I don't think that I necessarily said anything. And so what? It didn't look great, like. Yeah. Okay. It didn't look great at all. Oh dear. Okay. Anton has come to talk to Big Brother. Did you enjoy your time in the crypt? Oh, I loved it. Obviously, I learned that Harry's a professional backstabber. You know what? What Harry does, which I don't like. I don't like this. Yeah. And you, you know, for a fact, I don't roll like this. Yeah. What Harry does is he'll slag someone off behind their back, but then to their face go, "Oh, you're right. <laughs> Hello. You're right. Oh, that's, that's a nice top." You're right. No, don't don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Harry is trying to make amends with Louise. I hope I don't sound sick No, you don't at all. And I, uh, and God knows what they heard or what they thought they heard, but I, you don't at all. And I, the way you express yourself and the way you respect yourself and your family just comes across so strong. And, yeah. and I think you're a great character for it and the fact that Thank you. you know, you, are a model, but you're not the stereotypical model. I would never think you were thick. I would never call you thick. And, uh, that, cause no, no one's ever called me thick before. I was a little bit annoyed when I first heard it, but don't worry about Gen it. Genuinely, sorry if you were upset or anything. It's fine now. I still get this with my business message there. Hopefully, you feel the same. Don't worry about it, Ira. being the perfect gentleman and apologising. So, will it be Anton, Harry, Jay or Jem jetting out of here tonight? Find out more in four. to Big Brother and eviction number six. Now, when you're in that house, you really do miss certain things from the outside world. As it is, Jay is hungry for his nan's dumplings. Aw. Anton wants to bounce with his boys, yes. Harry desperately wants to hug his honey, yes. And Jem, well, Jem is longing for the two men in her life, Russell, and Jim. <laughs> Even so, none of the four want to go home tonight. I don't want to leave tonight because I feel like I've, I've been up and I've been down in this place. I've had my highs, I've had my lows. I've been the good guy, the villain. And I'm just, you know, one thing I would say is I've just been real from start to finish, completely myself, 100% Anton. And, you know, I, I want to stay. I want to stay to the end. So I need you guys to help me, please. I don't want to go home tonight because I'm having an amazing time. Honestly, the um, the experience is just unbelievable. Like, I, you know, I I couldn't have asked for a better experience. And I, I think, you know, if if I were to li if I were to go tonight, then it would just, it would, yeah, it would just really be gutting to find that I wasn't able to finish off my last few weeks of the experience.